so here is another question on converting signed binary numbers into s complement form into decimal form so the two signed binary numbers are 0 1 0 0 triple 1 0 and then we have 1 0 double 1 double 0 1 0 so first the usual step assignment of weights so 2 to the power 7 2 to the power 6 2 to the power 5 2 to the power 4 power 3 power 2 power 1 power 0 ok then we write the sign binary number so first we have 0 1 0 0 triple 1 0 so here the sign bit is 0 so it is a positive number ok because the sign bit is 0 now here we have to do the usual thing like we do the sign bit the msv bit carries a negative weight but it will not play any role because the sign bit is 0 so the decimal value will simply be the bit positions the one bits in the respective weight positions we have to just multiply with their weights and add them together 1 into 2 to the power 6 so 1 into 2 to the power 3 plus 1 into 2 to the power 2 plus 1 into 2 to the power 1 so it is 64 plus 8 plus 4 plus 2 72 plus 76 78 plus 78 so as uh, it was you know we saw the sign bit is 0 so it represents a positive number next is the other sign binary number so first weight assignment again 2 to the power 7 2 to the power 6 2 to the power 5 power 4 2 to the power 3 power 2 power 1 to the power 0 so the other binary number is it is given uh, one zero double one double zero then one zero so here as you can see the sign bit is one so it is a negative number because the sign bit the msv bit that is one so here it will carry a negative sign so 1 into 2 to the power 7 with the msv sign bit which carries a negative sign and the remaining one bits they will carry positive sign their respective weights so 1 into 2 to the power 5 plus 1 into 2 to the power 4 plus 1 into 2 to the power 1 and here the main difference between 2s and 1s complement is that in 2s complement we do not add a 1 at last but in 1s complement for negative sign binary numbers to convert them into decimal form we add a plus 1 at last so here the decimal value is equal to minus 128 plus 32 plus 16 plus 2 to minus 128 plus 50 which is equal to minus 78 so here again this is minus 78 this is plus 78 so obviously it means this binary number signed binary number is the 2s complement of 
this binary number okay one zero double one double zero one zero is the two s complement of zero one double zero triple one zero like i said for two s complement it is a, a bit difficult to visually identify from the bit patterns that there exists a two s complement relationship between them whereas for one s complement it is comparatively easy because in one s complement it is just one time inversion of bits zero is changed to ones ones are changed to zeros but in two s complement we have to first take the one s complement and then add one to the lsp of the one s complement so this two step process makes it a bit difficult to visually identify it so my suggestion to you never take chances with two s complement by just looking at the bit patterns just double check it okay so this is the thing this is the uh, question on 2s complement to decimal conversion so here is another question on determination of the decimal values of signed binary numbers expressed in 2s complement form so the two signed binary numbers are first one 0101 0110 Second one is one zero one zero one zero one zero. So, the first step is assignment of weights. The seven eight bit numbers. So, this is the format. Okay. So the first number is zero one zero one zero double one zero. Okay. Now examination of the sign bit. The sign bit is zero, so it is a positive number. Okay, because the sign bit is zero. Now. the msb or sign bit carries a negative weight but it will not play a role here because it is zero the sign bit is zero so as usual to calculate the uh, the decimal value we will multiply the respective uh, one bits with their respective weight positions so 1 into 2 to the power 6 plus 1 into 2 to the power 4 Plus one into two to the power two. Plus one into two to the power one. So it is sixty-four plus sixteen plus four plus two. So it is sixty-four plus sixteen is eighty. Eighty plus four eighty-four plus two eighty-six. So plus eighty-six. So it is a positive number. of magnitude 86 now for the second sign binary number again the first step is assignment of weights for 7 for 6 5 4 3 2 Or two, or one, zero. The second sign binary number is one zero one zero one zero one zero. So examination of sign bit, the MSP bit, it is one, so it is a Negative number because the sign bit is one. Now it carries a negative weight, so the decimal value will be equal to minus one into two to the power seven plus. The remaining will be plus the remaining one bit, so one into two to the power five. One into two to the power three plus one into 
2 to the power 1. So it is minus 128 plus 32 plus 8 plus 2. So it is equal to minus 128 plus 42 which is equal to minus 86 so it is minus 86 see this is minus 86 this is plus 86 so from this we can conclude that this binary representation is the 2s complement of this binary number this one but again just by looking at them you cannot be so sure about whether the following bit pairs bit uh, representation pairs the two s complements of each other because of the two step process of two s complement first bit inversion then adding one to the lsp so that makes it the process a bit difficult to visually identify whether they are 2s complement pairs or not okay but always go with the uh, normal process first assignment of the weights to the respective bit positions then adding them adding the respective weights to calculate the decimal value and for negative sign binary numbers always examine the sign bit okay so when you have one in the sign bit it is a negative number so you have to assign a negative weight to it and the remaining process is the same and another important thing always remember in 2s complement in 2s complement method we do not add one at the last for negative sign binary numbers only in 1s complement we add one so most of the you know students when they are in the beginner phase they make this mistake they add one in the 2s complement and do not add one in the uh, 1s complement method which is the opposite so this is the common mistake so you avoid so this is the 